Yo, what's going on YouTube? This is Zach with IT Career Questions, and today I'm really excited to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Linux Academy, and that's who we are going to talk about today. As you guys know, and I've told you many times before, and if you are unaware, I will only talk about a company that I believe in. I will only talk about them if it's something that I think is valuable. And I try to provide you with the most valuable information that I can based on my research, based on my experience. And Linux Academy has brought their A game. I am currently taking the LPI Linux Essentials course from Linux Academy. I'm about 60 something percent done with that course. And I have enjoyed learning Linux every step of the way from these guys. They make it really enjoyable. It's really easy to follow along. And today we're gonna to talk about some of the different things that they offer because it's not just completely Linux. They are very Linux heavy, which is great. And I strongly encourage everyone to at least learn the basics of Linux. But if you are also looking for some of those advanced courses, they offer those as well. So let's get into the reason why I love Linux Academy. So as I previously said, they are more than just Linux. They offer cloud training. So if you wanna get trained on Google Cloud Platform, AWS or Azure, they have courses that are specifically dedicated to those different cloud platforms. They also offer courses for Docker. If you are unfamiliar with Docker, I'm going to have a video coming out on that very soon, but that is a technology that I strongly suggest that you look into, especially if you are wanting to learn more about cloud technologies. Docker is going to be something that is going to be very important to you in your learning path. They also offer different courses for OpenStack and DevOps as well. So that's kind of a rough overview of some of the different offerings that they have. If we go and look at my screen right now, we could see some of the different offerings that they have and the different courses that correlate to them. So AWS has quite a few different courses there. Azure is a new course for Linux Academy. Uh, they have the Google Cloud Platform. They have a couple different uh, courses for that. Of course, they have a lot of Linux material here. And also the DevOps. Here's some about containers with Docker there and then some OpenStack. So as you can see, their library is pretty vast, which is nice. It, you're not specifically limited to just Linux. You can also start learning the cloud platform technologies as those are something that are gonna be very important and you'll need to know going forward in the technology field. The next piece that I wanna talk about is their learning paths. And this is something that is really awesome because there's nobody out there that really does this. And this is something that is crucial to you if you have a specific role in mind that you are looking to fulfill. If we scroll through the different learning paths here, you can see that what they offer here is different courses that would align with the role that you want. So if we go to Linux System Administrator, Engineer, Senior Level, and we click on that, this is going to open up every course that you should take that will help familiarize yourself with being a Linux system administrator. This is something that is really cool because it allows you to look further into a role that you are looking to fulfill and take all of the courses and learn about all of the technologies that will help you get into that role. So that's something that is a little bit different. You don't necessarily have to follow some of the different courses within Linux Academy. If you're looking to just become a Linux system admin, you could just follow this learning path and that will help you gain your knowledge. And as you can see on my screen here, there are a lot of different learning paths that they offer. So let's click on one more. Here's Amazon Web Services Master Level. As you can see here on my screen, here are the different courses that they recommend so that you can become a master at AWS. And if we click into that, we can see that here's the AWS Concepts. It's about an hour and six minutes long. And here are all the different sections of the course. And of course, it shows you how long they are. So it's really easy to consume a lot of this stuff in chunks. You don't have to sit down for a long amount of time to go over these courses because of the fact that they break them up. Another thing that I really enjoy about Linux Academy, because this is something that is actually really crucial to my learning, I love to speed up videos when I'm learning something. And it's not that they move too slow, it's that I wanna move faster. I wanna learn as quickly as I can. Linux Academy also offers hands-on labs, and this is something that is really crucial to your learning path. With the hands-on labs, you're able to spin up different virtual machines and then follow along with your course. This is crucial because of the fact that you may not have access to an AWS server or an Azure server. So being able to get into these hands-on labs is gonna be something that is going to help you learn about the cloud, about OpenStack, 
or learn more about containers. So they offer a lot of different hands-on labs. If you look at my screen right now, you can see that if we it keeps going. I mean, here we go, OpenStack hands-on labs. They have quite a few different OpenStack labs. They have different challenges and quizzes that you can take with the hands-on learning. Another really cool thing about Linux Academy to go along with their hands-on labs is their cloud servers. You are able to spin up up to 20 different Linux distributions all from their website. Completely virtualized, you access it all through your web browser, and it's amazing. It is so cool that you are able to do that. You are able to get familiar with all these different distros, and you don't have to use any of your computer's resources besides your browser, and that's great. It's really easy to do. You can have up to six different machines running simultaneously. I've played around with this many a times and I really enjoy it. And I'm really glad that I'm able to spin up, you know, a sent OS VM right on the fly. So that way I can get into that distribution and start learning what's different about that from Kali Linux, for instance. Again, the fact that they offer cloud servers is something that is really important because you might not have access to a home lab or you might be out on the go and, or on vacation, on a business trip, whatever the case may be and you're able to spin up these VMs and start learning. Follow along with one of the different courses that they offer, spin up that VM, test all your commands out in the, in the CLI, and see what you can do. And you can't break anything. That's the cool thing. So look into that because I really enjoy that. Another great thing that they offer from over there is their community tab, which this lets you get into their Slack. It also lets you interact with other students and with some of the instructors. And this is really cool because you are able to actually talk to other people and find out what they're working on. Maybe you can ask for help or just talk about tech in general. And that is something that I always tell people to do because if you're talking about it, you will more than likely find something that you are going to learn based on conversations that you have with other people. So I strongly suggest looking into that as well because that is also important to your learning path. So that's it for today's video. I really wanted to cover why I enjoy Linux Academy. Right now you can join and save 150 bucks, which is a lot of money and it's worth it. It's worth every penny to be able to access those cloud servers and the hands-on labs. If you guys are looking to learn Linux, AWS, Azure, whatever the case may be, Linux Academy has been a godsend for me and I really enjoy what they're doing over there. If you have used Linux Academy, I really would love to hear from you guys in the comments. I know a few of you have already signed up for Linux Academy based on a couple of the videos that I've done already. Please let me know how your experience has been. Do you enjoy it? Is there stuff that you want to see more of? Let me know in the comments. I would really love to hear from you guys. And if you haven't checked them out yet, there is a link in the description. Just click on that link. It'll take you over to Linux Academy. And if you sign up, let them know that I sent you. Let them know that you came from IT Career Questions because I would greatly appreciate that. If you want to see more Linux videos, again, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you are looking to see. I will be doing more Linux videos because this is something that I'm learning. I'm hoping that I can get through this LPI Linux Essentials course and then actually take the certification because I have honestly enjoyed learning Linux. I've said this numerous times already, but it's the truth. It's really fun to learn. It's something that, as I've said in many videos before, it's always intimidated me and it doesn't intimidate me anymore. It's not as scary as it sounds. And the fact that Linux is absolutely everywhere is going to be crucial to being in the IT field in the future. So hit up the link in the description, leave me comments. I'd love hearing from you guys. If you have any other comments, questions, suggestions, please let me know in the comments as well. As always, take it easy.